Hello everyone, this is Dude 14 uh, Today we have an LCD backlight, which I'll be using as a video light for video lighting. Um, most of my videos have been very uh, yellowish and shadowy, and I really don't like that. It doesn't look professional, it doesn't look very good. And if I have an HD camera, I figure I should have, you know, good lighting, because that makes video look better. I mean, it doesn't matter if it's 1080p or 4K, if, if you have crappy lighting, it's not going to look good. So, um... I'm going to use much better lighting here. This is an old backlight. I just tore it from an old LCD from the dump. And um, it's a Samsung. I said Samsung on the sticker in there. It's hard to see. Uh, these are the connections to the um, inverter, which I also was able to remove right here, this board um, I have. And I, if I, once I figure out how these 12 pins work, like I'm, I'm trying to research the pinouts online and stuff, then I should be able to drive this backlight and use it for video lighting. It'll produce a nice, clean, white light. I'm really excited for this project. Uh, let's get started. Okay, I have now sourced both the power supplies I'll be needing. This one supplies 5 volts, this one supplies 15. Just like the pins need on the LCD backlight here, the uh, inverter. So um, I'll just show you that this one supplies 15. Uh, I believe this positive goes in the middle. Yep, 15.0504, yeah. It's going to be a little jumpy, but because, you know, it's not the cleanest connection, but it's as close as I can get. So that's good. 15 volts coming from that. 5 from this. So it's all set. All right. I did the soldering to the right points. These are all ground, our 0 volts. And now I'm going to connect it up. This is the uh, moment of truth here. I've not tested this yet, so I really hope it lights up. Let's see what happens. <gasps> oh. So did you see that? It lit up for a second, but now it's it's off. So for some reason... It only lit up briefly, which is kind of disappointing. I'm going to try it. Let's see if I can do it again. Hopefully I didn't burn anything out or something. I really hope I didn't. Let's see. Do this. Then 15 volts. Oh, it still went off. So something, something is making it light up and then turn back off, which is unfortunate. Um, hmm. Maybe if I do it at the same time. Let's see if I hold these steady. See if I can plug them in at exactly the same time. Can I? Nope. Hmm. Okay, well, it is lighting up. That is good to see. But, um, for some reason here, it looks like it lights up briefly and then it shuts back off. So I'm going to have to look at my um, wiring again. Maybe I'll check the points, make sure that they're all connected properly again. Uh, maybe then it'll stay on. That is strange. See the pinkish? Yeah. So, uh, unfortunately, uh, the project was not successful, and I will not have a uh, video backlight. Well, at least with this backlight. Um, it was successful with the inverter and the connections and everything, so maybe I'll just disconnect the inverter and try to look for another uh, display. But um, for now, unfortunately, I do not have any other source, so I'll have to use um, the usual sources for... Uh, light, just like the lamps and stuff around. Uh, it's been a great learning experience. I learned something new. I got, I got to get this to work, so that's that's always good. And not every project's going to be successful, so I felt that I should still share this project, even though it wasn't a successful project. And, uh, you know, good to learn something new. Uh, and uh, I'll just move on to the next project for next month. So, um, thanks for watching. Please be sure to subscribe if you liked the video. And we'll see you next month.